I think we're safe. Uh-oh. What is going on? No! 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 Oh no! We are running. It was a ninja. And she just tried to slice me like a salami. Well, that I was hoping would be our, our safe place, but I guess I'm stranded now. But welcome. I am Joseph Swain. I'm a failed police officer who, with his prized vest, is trying to survive in a hostile world where everyone hates you. May maybe because of the vest? Or the shoes? Maybe that is because they don't match? Who knows? But yes, I am a failure of a cop trying to live in a, in a zombie-filled world full of haters. The haters gonna hate on the vest. But you know what? I love it. Oh, a car. And some zombies. Possibly some clothing for me? I'm going to see whether or not I can lure a few. Joseph Swain is very ill-equipped. You could say he's the, the illest equipped. This man has a helmet and leather gloves. That might be a bucket hat. Wait, let's have a look. A beanie hat. All right. We are becoming this man. Nobody will ever know the difference. I'm sure his name was Ted. I'm going to take everything. Even his socks. Socks are actually very important. We, are, we weren't wearing any. All right. Now that we look like some stripper, we're going to deal with these other few. Okay, this is actually looking good. Let's let's ignore let's ignore the good clothing for now. Just need to get rid of these zombies. I spent a lot of money on these purple, maybe pink shoes, but I need to use them till we at least get some sort of weapon. So we got a hammer from this trunk. So we now have a weapon. I'm going to attach that to my belt. Now we're looking like a true builder. Maybe this could be my new profession. I shouldn't have smashed the left window, but I'm a bit nervous. Okay, candy cane and matches. Not bad. No key, though. <gasps> a sledgehammer. We're going to complete the look of looking kind of like a stripper. We just got to take the shirt off again. <gasps> a key in the trees. Oh, this is perfect. Although I may have got rid of the wrong window. We'll see. Does it have... It has gas in. Oh, it has so much gas in. <gasps> oh, wow. We've come across the jackpot. It is in incredibly bad condition. This is a 10%. It has a lot of gas. Could I get away with it? In all honesty, I'm a pretty bad cop, and I'm not very well clued in on the map of Knox County, where everything is. So, maybe a car would be best, because it might be a long journey. But that didn't take long. Ah! This seems to be a dead end. I think this car will fall apart if we try and use it off-road, so let's go... Let's go back. We'll try another way. We're going to head up and take a left here. See where this takes us. Oh. Seems to be... Car crash here. Plastic bag? Oh, yes, please. Right, this is enough for us to put stuff in. I want a jack and a lug wrench. Perfect. We can do work on cars now. Although our mechanic skill is nothing. Well, minor, but not insignificant. A truck. 
And a person with a bag? Oh. An actual bag. What a lovely hat you have there, sir. Wow, two of these men have bags for me. Crash dealt with. We're gonna have to wear a yellow and black lumberjack shirt. And we now have a satchel. And a digital watch, which is an upgrade. Should be able to see the temperature and the date now. But it's the 7th of the 9th, I believe. It changes between British and, and American. I keep forgetting which one it is in this game. That bag matches my gloves better. I prefer this one. Fashion is also very important. Which is why we have a pink vest, of course. I don't know, shall we go with the white hat or the blue hat? I prefer the white hat. This truck might have something important for us. I see a saw on the ground, which is going to be very helpful. Wood glue. Not bad at all. I'm going to put the rest of this in the satchel. Having something in your secondary, I, I, I try and avoid. I feel like it would just be very cumbersome. Right, let's smash open the right side window. Not make the same this it not make the same mistake that I did last time. Come on, keys. Nope. Nothing. Nothing at all. Does this thing even have gas? It has a full tank of gas. And it's technically in better condition than my current car, but we have no key. So, unfortunately, I'm gonna have to ditch it. Ah, oh, crossroad. Hmm. Let's go... Let's go up the dirt road. This is not a good sign. Oh, that sounds closer than I thought, actually. They're at TIS construction. Oh, and there's a... Th yeah, there's... Oh, there's a whole group here. Alright. Maybe not the place for us. And it seems like there's quite a few coming through the trees, so we should get out of here. Oh, there's... A oh, no, no, no. I do not want Lorraine and Charles shooting at me. I'm gonna go through here. I wonder whether or not they're infiltrating that. It seemed like there was a lot of people inside. Maybe they were fighting each other. Or part of one big group. But... Especially with a car like this, I do not want to risk it. Let's just go up here. <sighs> Damn truck. Oh, wow. What was that? Are there people here? Are from these zombies? What the hell was that noise? Look, it's twinsies. That's so cute. They're, the only difference is that they have different, different socks. That's so cute. I'm going to take their long socks. Which one do I want? <gasps> a key. I prefer blue. There we go. That does definitely not make me look more like a nerd. It seems like they were delivery. Delivery people. No gasoline. Always a bad sign. Annotated map. Not really in the business for that right now. Oh, cooking for beginners would be handy though. We'll take that for later. 
Ooh, a tote bag. That's probably better than this plastic bag, right? 8.30. 12.50. Yes. Better. We have a bag upgrade. Nothing else, though. Well, a little stash. Nothing amazing. I'm not sure what that bang was. So we're going to escape at two miles per hour, apparently. Come on. Come on, Sheila. You can make it. Yes, I called my truck Sheila. Come on, you can do it. I believe. Come on! Wiggle that tire! Yes! I still don't think this truck can start whilst turning. For some reason it then decides to... turn the opposite way? Come on. Somehow that made it. Maybe it was getting caught on the tree. But we're out. Or, well, we're out, but going very slowly. Hello there. Were you nomming on a survivor by any chance? denim shirt would actually be better for us. Now let's just get into my extremely slow car that can barely go forward. I think Sunday Driver kind of breaks this. Makes me go incredibly slowly. Ugh. Sheila, come on. Giving me road rage. To be honest, I don't think we'll... Oh, it was a tire that we lost. That was the sound. Oh, that makes so much sense. Well, we lost the back tire. Does that mean... Does that mean we have no back tires? Is it, Were we driving a three-wheeler? I've barely had this happen to me, so I didn't realize. We... We're trying... <laughs> yes, we were driving a three-wheeler, and now it's only a two-wheeler. Alright, so we're missing both of the back tires, so... I think this car can't go on for very much longer. If at all, so... We're going to have to walk. Well, this is... Probably gonna be quite a long trip. I'm not great with knowing where I'm going. Or even where my destination is, but... We'll get there. I'm a, I'm a good cop. Anyway, this might be a good time to check our character. He's got thin skinned, prone to illness, weak stomach, short sighted, slow reader, Sunday driver, dexterous, fast learner, hunter, and dropped out of police academy. Joseph Swain is generally ass. He can aim a gun, and he's fairly fit and strong, but He's got nothing else going for him, which is most likely why he failed police academy. He still likes to tell people that he's a police officer, but really, with the zombie outbreak, this is his time to redeem himself after the shambles of the academy. We're gonna ditch our, we're gonna ditch our bag just to shed a little bit of weight because we don't want to be under under a heavy load. Alright, so we made it pretty far. 
but let's end the episode here. Thank you to everyone who's watched throughout this. This is my first time doing like a proper edited video. So I hope you guys like it. And be sure to subscribe if you want to follow the journey of Joseph Swain. And feel free to check out the Discord. It'll be in the description. A list of mods, like always, will be in the description also. I hope to see you again. And Joseph says bye-bye.